I'm the Beast Manager and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, the Frosty Planet Pack DLC. And oh my god, my friends, it is so hot on site. How much I would love to be in a frosty planet right now. But well, speaking about uh, hot, today, my friends, we will try and finish the upgrade to our steam power plant. Uh, kind of would like, if at all possible, on this episode to get the all steam ahead achievement by uh, getting rid of this. We already have a plan in motion, but before that plan can be realized, we must first guarantee that our power plant is up to the task. After all, it is just a temporary uh, power plant just yet. It is not yet finished. And so we still need to do all of this in here as well. A bunch of piping and still acquire a bunch of resources because steel is quite lacking and we need uh, to build at least two more aqua tuners, get more plastic for steam turbines, a bunch of things. So, if everything goes right, we will get this done, put a bunch of odd stuff inside of this thing, get this unstuck and get ourselves an achievement. But will we be able to do it? Well, you probably already know, because if I did it, it is in the thumbnail. And if it is not, it's because I didn't. But I am pres I am past me right now. For you. But for me, I'm only present me. No matter how many cycles pass, my friends. I think I, I look at this and I see no progress whatsoever. Oh my lord, these little dupes, they have to come from f so far away. And, this, and these resources are just spread all over the place. One of the... Fe one of the uh, Next things that we are going to do is organize our resources just to speed up big projects like this. I'm certain if the resources are in the same spot with the two next to them, things like this will be done much quicker. But well, you know, since they are so busy doing that, I think it's time for me to start planning ahead, you know. We'll have to, uh, we'll have to put a, a few of these down and uh yeah we also have to uh, open up the chamber again hopefully all of this mercury is more than enough to keep these at bay um yeah we need to go over here finish this uh we kind of want to get access to that uh, sulfur if at all possible we'll also have to build a few extra things in here but first i <laughs> just have to wait i just need to be patient well, in theory, our episode would be starting today, right? If it was not for all that uh, insanity a few episodes ago. But hey, 10 cycles have elapsed and they uh, actually got some stuff done. I'm starting to get my hopes up that we actually will get this done today. Hmm. Interesting. So, we are technically in a vacuum. There is no way for that heat to escape. And yet... The water is at 74, 75 degrees, instead of the typical 95 it should be. I am perplexed and confused. Today we shall... Oh man, they, they spent like 5 minutes killing uh, spigot seals and only in the final field did I decide to say anything. I was gonna say today we're gonna seal hunting. And we're gonna hit the nice, but uh, yeah. Wait. They don't give in meat when they perish. Oh. Huh. That's interesting. And as per usual, whenever we get something nice out of the blueprint, uh, out of the printing pod, I like to get you guys. I like to uh, let you guys know. Today we get a confetti suit. Look at how nice it is. So beautiful. Still no um. Man, I sometimes no snazzy suit. Yeah, that's what I meant to say. The, the like uh, the advanced snazzy, snazzy suits, you know, the greens and the purple ones. Those are my favorite. Well, technically, technically speaking, this one is my favorite. But the other ones are better, so I I just like to pretend, you know. You know what, my friends? Sometimes you just gotta do what you gotta do, you know. Sometimes you just need to crack a few eggs to uh, to get stuff done. Unfortunately, cannot fit it in there. It would be perfect. Uh, but, uh, you know, the dupes can still do it, you know, uh, maybe over here, this thing will pick up the egg, put it in there, end up in here, then this thing pick it up and send it into the kitchen where we can make some omelettes, I suppose. All of this because we are missing 200 steel. Just 200, you know. 
those 200 are the final bit of materials that we are missing. Once we have those 200, we'll have all of the materials to make everything. It's just a matter, of course, of building it. Which... I don't know, it, it, it's taking their sweet time, okay? Let's just put it in those in those terms, but uh, yeah, let's crack a few eggs, shall we? This is already done, let's see, how many eggs do we have? Does it tell me we have 28 units of those, one unit of that, that's uh, precious. Three of those, six of those, those are precious as well. So, technically, we need 20 kilograms, which would mean killing 20... Oh my god. God, that's way too much. Let's do 10, because at least 10 is a, it's like a work order, you know? That's the, the, oh man, they're gonna, they're gonna, um, they're gonna have a lot of omelets, okay? Let's just put it that way. Uh, by the way, by the way, by the way, uh, eggshells. Why you not putting in eggshells, hmm? Hmm? Come on. Oh, also, pl uh, please send the eggshells into the freezer, even though they shouldn't be there, you know, it's one of those things. Uh, why is this made out of steel? You guys are stealing? The game is stealing the steel out of me. That's not a good no, sir. Now, my friends, given that we have like three work orders remaining and we still are waiting on the final bits of steel, like... We have 50 kilograms right here in that thingy, but I'm still missing 25. I went into the material overlay and looked everywhere for it. I just cannot find it. We'll have to wait until it is done. Now, I could, like, I found these. We could go over here and deconstruct that. But at the same time, these are unique buildings that we cannot rebuild later. So, you know, I'd just rather wait a little bit. So in the meantime, oh look at that, it's already done. This one uh, will have to wait until this is done so that I can put the block right there. There is a block missing so that we can put the water in. Uh, so that's why. In any case, time to get back inside of the chamber, my friends. Oh wait, I, I, I still need to do that. But yeah, while we wait for the seal, it shouldn't be uh, that much longer. Uh, let's open this up. And let's go in here. Well, there is plenty of tasks that we need to do. We need to come over here. We need to deconstruct all of this. We need to reseal this chamber. Make sure we don't break through here and uh, have all of that garbage in here. Right? Uh, I swear, if we get that oxygen in, I'm gonna be so mad. I don't even. Okay? I don't even. Let's hope that I don't get that mad. But yeah. Breaking into the chamber. Uh, next cycle, of course. Alright. Into the chamber we go. And this is gonna drop down. And uh, no. Perfect. We have a perfect seal. Now the temperature, of course, it's going to uh, increase. Uh, we had steel trapped inside of the chamber. I it's either that or a work order got done. I don't care. We got the, the steel now. We got the steel. There we go. Steel, steel. All right. Go for it then. Uh, it's just one work order, so let's focus on another, uh, on more work orders, like, for example, let's build a protective shield for the stuff over there. These things like to spew out, uh, stuff. I don't know, like, I don't think it's gonna break that, but uh, you never knew, you know? So, you know, let's just get, uh, some, um, the protection going. I could probably put it over there. And it would be fine. Eh, but I just don't want to risk it. In any case, everybody, get in here. Mine everything. I said mine everything. You can mine it all. It's fine. Yep, there we go. Bang, bang, bang. Let me see. Anything that might melt over here? No, not gonna melt. Not gonna melt. Not gonna melt. Not gonna melt. Okay. So, in theory, we don't have anything that could melt. Alright? So, even though there is like a... Uh, 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 air, like uh, the the thickness of one air protecting this uh, area from that area, it, it, like it's still blocked. So don't don't give me any of that shenanigan. You okay, game? Okay. Alrighty, that part is now done. Meaning we can now go over here, select that, bada beam, bada boom, close that. Now, unfortunately, this is gonna be a problem, but uh, you know, that's why we have a cooling loop right there. 
so that this problem is not that that big of a problem you know uh, we could technically like try to vacuum a bit out blah 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 nah 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 nah, nah. too much effort okay that's just that's just too much effort <laughs> although it would be you know let's see it will be right there it is possible we do have the materials for it now nah screw it oh come on guys like do we really think about the consequences over here we obviously don't uh, now please build these with the utmost urgency perfect nothing got in here now i noticed one tiny little thing our breath fiber the stock Oh my god, this is still a problem right now. I, like, I cannot pay attention to everything. What seems to be the problem? You're joking, one degree below the, the, the thingy. Oh, I really need to take care of this, like, right now. It's gonna be the next thing, okay? That's gonna be the next thing, because it's actually important. Because, uh, uh, yeah, this thing is uh, is, is very important. It is, it is our only source of fibers. These big creatures and they pretty much they, uh, they, they 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 are born and then you know what um oh my god it's gonna be a mess but screw it where is the thingy utilities temperature shift plate we do have a bunch of ice just laying around like polluted ice is extremely cold do we have brine ice we do not polluted ice it is then screw this i'm getting mad there we go it's gonna generate because, you know, I don't want them to die. I'm tired of them dying and not being able to reproduce them. Because things are one degree below the things they should. In here, the same. But in here, it's whatever. This, whenever it melts, it's going to create a problem. But the problem is not right now. Right now, the problem is that they cannot eat. And once it melts, you go over here, we deal with it later, you know? So, like, Ashkan, please, just, 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 I need the fibers, okay? Wow, okay, it melted immediately. It melted immediately. Oh my god, it's gonna be worse than I thought. Why did I build that like that? Why am I so dumb sometimes? Well, it's fine. Problem solved, look at that, see? Okay, so, in here, I think I have built everything. I, I swear to god, if I'm missing something, I'm gonna be so mad. You guys have no idea. Now, the piping is a bit weird over here because these are built backwards and this was already built and I didn't want to rebuild everything. Why is this one a different color? Steel? Steel. Well, matters matters little. This is done. This is done. Like, the piping seems to be fine. All the bridges seem to be pointing in the right direction. Nothing seems to be built out of order. Okay. This is connected, connected, connected. Okay. Can we get it done now? Awesome. So... First, Brian, go grab it. ASAP. Now, my friends, here's the thing. The plan was to put a bunch of liquid sulfur inside of that thing. I just forgot one thing. We need more steel for that. More steel. Of course. Do I really want to wait? No, no, I don't. Okay, I'm impatient. I'm an impatient man. Okay, that's one of my many flaws. So, I'm just gonna fix this part of the power plant, and then we are just gonna try, okay? We're gonna make a test drive, and see if we can bring this temperature up with just glass. That's the easiest path to getting what we want. And you guys know me, I love easy, okay? I hate doing things the complicated way, and then I end up making things the extremely complicated way. You know, because... That makes total sense. Stop lying. You're not starving. You're just on the other side of the airlock. Like, this drives me insane. Body temperature again. You gotta be joking. How is this possible? Like, the, are you telling me I'm gonna, I'm gonna forever lose my marbles? Alright, my friends, so I think that this should cover us pretty nicely. There we go. All of the carbon dioxide has just been expelled. Yep. Yes, it has. Let's just do that so that we call in another delivery of water. Uh, just to make sure we have plenty of steam available from whenever we start building this thing. And it's done. 
we can close off this thing and technically... Oh wait, no, we still need to uh, finish off this part, but hey, we can turn off this part because uh, we'll be able to turn on the other uh, bits of the power plant. Uh, so, go down, perfection, bam, bam, shazam, now we go over here, build, 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 priority like as high as we can. These are priority ones so that the dupe doesn't do the engineering uh, tune-up. Uh, on them, because, uh, you know, dupes are not the smartest creatures, they, uh, they see a power plant uh, stopped for like uh, 10 cycles and they're like, hmm, I'm gonna tune you up because we never know when we might need you. Alrighty, my friends, so, how are we gonna put coolant inside of these pipes? They are very far away from anything interesting, right? wrong we have this pipe that we built for uh the water that we had over there and uh you know we can make some uh, interesting things happen like for example we can go over here we need to castle of course and then we snip that snip that snip that over there then build it over there so it goes through here right right but we are not done yet oh no we're not um Man, this bridge is a bit in the way. Let's get rid of it, shall we? But yeah, after the bridge, we just go through here and all the way over here. And then we can connect the pipes in a very special way. We're not just gonna connect the pipe directly. Okay, pipe has been deconstructed. We go over there, cancel that. I like to, to do the cancelling every time I, I build over a pipe so that it doesn't uh, get a work order. So we go through here, through here, through this uh, ginormous mess. And now... How are we gonna do this? Well, we'll have to uh, kind of do things in order, right? This is the most inner pipe, right? Now, I, we, we have four pipes, and yet I only see three, which is preoccupying. Uh, so let me just double check that I'm not being stupid right here. Oh yeah, we have this one over here. Okay, 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 okay. This one... We do second to last, okay? We can just go over here. And, uh, but it's gonna be... It's not gonna be great. No, it's not. Well, we'll we'll find a way. Because, you see, the way we are gonna put water into our pipes, it's utilizing bridges. Now, the bridge is a very useful thing in this matter. Please cancel that. Thank you. It's a very, very... Oh, man. God damn it, you... You building stuff all over the place where you shouldn't. Stop replacing my stuff. In any case, the bridge will allow us to only put in the stuff we actually need without overpressurizing the entire thing, which is bad, okay? That's really bad. We don't want to put too much uh, coolant into the pipes because as the coolant is traveling through the bridge, there is a, a split second where a, uh, a space is opened and a packet is pushed through. But because that package was push, push through whenever this thing was already uh, full, and now the line will uh, go in e uh, like in hiccup e modes, right? It won't flow steadily. It will just go stop, go stop, go stop. We use bridges to um, prevent that because uh, if it is like this in a T, uh, it will force the packet through. But if it is a bridge, it will not. All right. So first line in. Position. Go! Okay, so here comes the coolant. Oh, wait. Uh, this line... Which line is this one? Because this one we won't be able to fill up. It's the one that we're trying to fill up right now. Because, of course, it is... Oh, my God. That just sucks so much. It just sucks so much. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. We'll find a way. We'll find a way. Alright, let's stop. It's fine. Uh, this fluid will just go through there and then we'll get stuck in one of these bridges. Because it won't be able to flow through. Uh, so what we are gonna do... Okay, new plan. Uh, we're gonna do a few rearrangements of our pipe so that we can actually put coolant in this very first pipe. Which is the one that powers, or in this case cools, um, this set of power plants. We turn this one off, turn this one on, because it will have cooling, fix the thermoregulation, and then finish up 
uh, this bit. It's just a shame that we are now putting the, 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 the things exposed uh, to this temperature. Because this, this is super uh, co uh, cold and so it was uh, going to be useful uh, because of that. Because it, uh, it would uh, inject chillness into the base, but that's fine. That's totally fine. I just need you guys to deconstruct this liquid bridge and it will be a golden. Okay, so here we go. Hopefully, the, like, there is so many bridges. This pipe is not complete. What am I missing? I'm being a bit... Dumb, dumb. Oh! Uh, of course, like, it connects over there. Sorry, guys, I'm... Look, this is complicated, okay? I, I, I entitled myself to doing a dumb dumb here, here and there, okay? So, here we go. Start to input the stuff into the place where the stuff needs to be. Okay, oh, also, uh, program the thing to be send green signal if above let's say 10 degrees all right that sounds like an excellent temperature to be at okay. so here we go uh, we'll be able to see these things stop and there we go see it completely stopped no more no more and uh, that's actually good because now we can come over here Deconstruct this liquid bridge like uh, very very fast if at all possible and then we can utilize this water this extra water in the pipe and put it into the next pipe hmm. The water goes immediately into super toasty mode like there is like no not even a chance in hell that this thing can oh my god I don't even know if polluted water is good enough. It should be it should be I'm pretty certain I use polluted water in my nuclear power plant and in that build, it can sustain six thingies. Like, I am 95% sure. Uh, but, well, it matters little. We can now turn this off. We can go over here. And turn this one on. And uh, then we'll monitor the situation when it comes to the temperature of these things. See if the heat rises up too much. If not, uh, we'll have to see. Which means that now we can, uh, for uh, for a change, get uh, all of these um, all of this polluted water in there, get rid of the uh, of it, and then replace it with ethanol, and then send it upstairs. But of course, that's gonna be done afterwards. Right now, we have far greater pressing concerns. Uh, problem: we don't have more aluminum. Oh man, I completely forgot. We need one, two, three, four, five. Oh my God, four work orders. Can you can you sustain that without breaking? Because you know this thing, it, it is very toasty. Um. Uh, 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 uh. So give me four of these with the utmost urgency, please. Uh, perfect. 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 It's just the bridges that are built backwards. Okay, like I said, my friends. I allow myself this level of uh, 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 um, derpiness, okay? Uh, but yeah, the dupes like actually build this ultra quickly. I, I'm surprised. Okay, so here we go. The second uh, loop in is now getting. F I, I'm 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 I'm, I'm, I'm gonna lose my marbles because I'm stupid. I'm so stupid. I built the entire thing backwards, because of course I did. Obviously. Obviously, the base manager, you obviously built every single one of these things backwards. God damn it. Oh my god, could you please stop being dumb again, base manager, please? I beg of you, stop being dumb and building things backwards, okay? There we go. Perfect. Build that now, like, please. All right, another cooling loop now built in the correct manner. Okay, okay. Going, and you go through there, bam, 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 and this thing should stop, like, right now. Boom, shakalaka. Look at that. The liquid bridges never let us down, my friends. They are always there for us. Build bridges, they say. Okay, my friends, here we go for the final bridge. Uh, all the other cycles are now going. I even already turned this one on. 
because uh, this is the uh, tuned up one, these ones are not too... Of course! <laughs> uh, you guys have nothing better to do now, do you? Ooh, ah, okay, here we go. Uh, 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 let me just connect over here. Bam, 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 that thing goes over there, beautiful. Let's just fill up this cycle now. Alright, my friends, so... The final bridge is now being decommissioned. We kind of will have to find a way to get rid of this. I don't know how yet, but it's a problem for future me. Current me now enjoys a power plant that should be operating at full efficiency now. I still kind of need to do one final thing. Automation-wise, I don't know when I'm going to build it. Probably... Let's say... I will have to redirect this pipe because I want a, way, a thermal regulator... Uh, not a thermal regulator, one of these things. Come on, show it to the people at home. This thing, the liquid pipe ther thermal sensor. We will be monitoring the temperature of the fluid so that we, you know, don't turn it into steam. Because that's bad. Now, I don't know, we, I, I, I'm pretty certain that will not, will not happen, but we never knew. So better to be safe than... You're seriously fucking with me, ain't ya? You're telling me that this is not good enough for you? Hm? Is that what you're telling me? Okay. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. Okay? I'll get rid of one or two. God damn it. Well, you know, mishaps are bound to happen. You know, it's fine. It's whatever. God damn it. Well, in any case, we have a lot of pressure inside of that thing. Let's uh, allow it to expel said pressure. Okay. And then we're going to try trial number one. Water plus glass. What could possibly go wrong? Okay, here we go. <clears throat> it's starting to pump out stuff and is locked. Alrighty, so now we'll just allow it to uh, do its thing, spew a bunch of uh, nonsense all over the place. Um, yeah. Oh, wait, it's... God damn it. Hm. Uh, the dupes deserve to sleep. Besides, we need to put water in there anyway, so it's fine. Um, Alright. Time to go back to school. Lead. Melts. 327. Now, uh, I noticed this thing is 150 degrees that gives it. However, however, you see that liquid temperature? I'm gonna go and, and place it above 327. Even the dogs outside are nervous about this situation, okay? I'm very nervous. The dogs are nervous. We are all nervous. Will we be able to do this? Or is the game gonna pull some shenanigans on us and tell us, uh, 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 I see what you're doing and I'm not gonna wait to allow it. Okay, here we go. I'm just uh, going to... That's not a lot, okay. Let's see. Temperature... Did nothing. That pretty much did nothing, bro! That, like, scratched the surface. Okay, just keep going, bro. You're doing just fan freaking tests. Tick. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna need a lot of glass, my friend. I, I was, like, feeling optimistic, you know, that uh, we probably were only gonna need a little bit. But no, 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 we're gonna need a lot of it. Now, in the meantime, we'll have to survive with these things, uh, our petroleum generators. It's fine, you know, we, uh, we still have them and we have a tank full of fuel, so uh, it is the perfect time to utilize it. Well, it does make sense that the temperature only goes up a couple of degrees. We are producing 25 molten glass uh, per uh, interaction. So, you know, it's it's perfectly normal. I'm just gonna take like uh, 8 billion years now. Awesome. I, I really... Do we have the steel now? Oh my god, we are missing like... <sighs> Please give me the steel. That's all that I ask is give me one more. One more of steel. Because, you know... Uh, like, it's not perfect, but at least it is of higher temperature, you know, the sulfur. 
and there is like a bunch of it. So, you know. Okay, my friends, we are seriously low on fuel already. That's, um. quite preoccupying, okay? Um. Yeah. We. This is gonna be very difficult. Um. Yeah, like. We are, like, like the temperature is not going up as fast as I uh, at first imagined. I don't think this is exactly, uh, I don't think the average is counting that well, because uh, we already put a bunch of glass in there. Okay, we already inputted a bunch of glass, and this thing is still just, nope, nope, okay, um, sure. Okay, so, this thing is built, pipe blocked, why, let's go. Do it as fast as possible. Okay, so here we go. Very toasty sulfur going 230 degrees. Come on, keep sending that. Our power grid is just absolutely destroyed. We have barely any power left. Uh, I, every once in a while, I have to turn one of these things on. Uh, although, doing it, like, I built this over here on purpose. I just, I just needed a little bit more power, you know? Just a little bit more, just a tad bit more power. So that I could just vacuum this sulfur. Well, I mean, we can do without power. You know what? You know what, guys? This thing is probably be, is probably the thing. Yanks! We can shut it off right now. It's probably the thing driving our power consumption just completely crazy. See, there we go. We are now producing power from this thing alone. Uh, so uh, yeah, cool. Uh, we'll reconnect it later, I just can't forget. So, let's see. Sulfur. It's already going in, yes it is. Is the temperature increasing? Very slowly, very slowly. We need to get that thing bare minimum to 200 degrees. Just so that the steam is hot enough for that thing. I don't know if we need to put it all the way to uh, 327 degrees. The temperature of the fluid going uh, uh, as it goes in, you know, the, the average temperature of the thing, so... I hope not, because uh, while we have plenty of uh, sulfur, it's not 12 tons, I uh, I think. Uh, I'm not liking this. I'm not liking this. The temperature is not going up fast enough. Like, what the hell? This is just ridiculous. I inject a bunch of odd stuff into this thing, and you're telling me that the average is 150 degrees. Like, the only water that went in was the water in this pipe. As the thing, you know, pressurized, it stopped absorbing out the water. There is like what? At best. Okay? At best. There is like what? Um, 200 kilograms. Okay, 270 kilograms right there. Right, right, right. 270 plus 40. And, and then, and then... Oh, come on, bro. Come on. Oh my god, please. Thank you. Come on, 500 kilograms, okay, of water, and then glass, and oh no, we're gonna fail, you gotta be joking, I'm so mad right now, I'm so mad. Uh, in an attempt to try and save this, we are going 100% for glass alone, for the fi uh, final, like, two turns, it's gonna take us like, uh, 8 billion work orders maybe, to get this one done. Uh, but I, I, I trust in my dupes. I trust in my dupes. And if this doesn't work, we're kind of screwed. Because we just placed a bunch of garbage in this thing. And it's a bun it's going to spew a bunch of hot garbage uh, that we then don't have a way to deal with because everything is stopped and we want this thing to work. Uh, why? Why is the game lying to me? This is a lie. That temperature is a lie. I can tell you guys. Trust me. That's an absolute lie. The game is lying. Liar. You liar! In any case, uh, while we wait, because, you know, power is nice, I'm just going to utilize the steam inside of the chamber and I'm going to cool it off, you know? Because we're going to have to deal with stupid, hot, hot stuff, so we might as well just cool off the chamber while we're waiting, you know? So, if my theory is correct, this is all that we need, plus just 0.1, right? If we have just one, uh, 0.1 more temperature, in theory, the gas will be heated up enough to delete the lead. Uh, but uh, I, I gotta be honest, I'm not very confident that it's gonna work the way I think it's gonna work. Hmm? 
Well, it's one of nine. One of nine. What? What? No, no, no. What's going on? Oh, oh my god. Hmm. I can't have a moment of glory in peace and quiet. No. That would be too much to ask, of course. Obviously. Why do you ask for so much? Hmm? You filthy peasant. Do you want to be... Do you want to be, uh... uh relaxed? Go please factory town. This is oxygen not included. You must be stressed at every given freaking time. Of course, made a mess because you could not hold your pee in for one second. I'm fixing the freaking thingy. But you could not hold your pee. No! Of course not! Yeah, everybody pee on the floor, yes, please! And there we go, they are just, uh, uh, like, they are just, uh, unable to, uh, control themselves. Pee. Everywhere. Disgusting. And they are gonna pee in their suits as well. Could you guys think about who is going to use the suit next? Couldn't you just relieve yourself in, in, like, in a, in a flower pot or something, like, uh, like a normal person? No! Of course not. Okay, so... Uh, the temperature has been achieved and I'm getting- I'm growing impatient. Okay, I'm growing impatient. I cannot hold anymore. We must get it done now. Okay, the temperature is there. The sulfur is outer. This is either gonna work or it's not gonna work. Okay, so let's just get it done. Today is the cycle that we are going to find out if this is gonna be worth it or if I just made myself a huge headache and there is no uh analgesic in the world big enough to fix it okay guys so here we go here we go so n there is no point in cutting this part now all right the moment of tension starts to rise here we go 100 kilos to go 12 and we got it fuck yeah oh my god i cannot believe it oh my duplicants have successfully cleared the- I'm sorry that I just burst the ER, ER, eardrums, okay? I'm, but uh, I, I get- I, I, I'm just so happy. My duplicants have successfully cleared the obstruction geovent. We can now maximize the full potential of this formidable heat and power source, and perhaps experiment with input temperature to produce more interesting secondary byproducts. My duplicants seem keen to commemorate this accomplishment by keeping the obstruction as something of a uh, of a trophy a lead third is now ours my friends god damn it amazing oh please tell me that we have a cinematic please tell me that we got a, the thingy and we have a cinematic let's go mm. Though the journey has been long and marked by challenges that often seem insurmountable, we have prevailed in harnessing this planet's core potential. We now stand proudly at the precipice of a sustainability-powered fu future. It is deeply humbling. I am hopeful that we have learned enough to wield this machinery more wisely than those who came before us. Well, we're still alive and they are not, so I would say that we have... And now we're gonna have, like, a billion achievements. Sorry, guys, but, uh... First time seeing this, so... See you in, like, five hours. Ah, oh, here we go, my friends. I am so happy. We got the shiny Copro Light thingy. And we did it in less than 50 cycles in theory, okay? Two cycles to spare in this episode. Look at that, before cycle 500. Oh my lord, it took us only like 40 hours of gameplay to get this thing done. It wasn't that bad. Now, do you know what's bad? Do you really want to know what's bad? What's about to happen to us? Let's just, let's see out of curiosity, what is gonna happen to us? Oh look! Solid glass being shot by that thing. 
Yeah, send some glass into that thing over there. And sulfur. And just a bunch of disgusting things. Now we need to reconnect this, of course, but uh, it's not that bad, actually. It's a, 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 oh, stop! What you doing? No, 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 no. Uh, damn it. I'm so stupid. Uh, like, from a moment of glory to a moment of stupidity. Stop putting that garbage in there. We need to clear the pipe, of course, but, uh, yeah. We can now get back to normal operations. Let's go full throttle. Well, I don't need full throttle on this, but, you know, we, we could if we want to, which is awesome. Oh my, I, like, I'm so happy. You know what, guys? I'm gonna have dinner now, and then I'll finish the episode, because this was just fan-freaking-tastic. And I deserve, like, I don't know, a steak or something. Well, I'm probably not the first to get it, but uh, I'm amongst the first, it doesn't even count yet. Oh boy, oh boy, my friends. I'm so happy. There was no steak in the freeze, freezer, I had to eat a sandwich. No, con 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 like, celebratory steak for me. Oh well, in any case, my friends, I'm really happy, really, really happy, yeah, just in case you couldn't tell. And, uh, you know, we are two cycles away from the theoretical end of this episode, and I think we're gonna take it, because these next 10 cycles are actually gonna be super helpful in our next episode, because now we have to fix everything we broke to get this working. Yep. Next episode, guess what? I'm already, I, I, I was already working on it. I already removed all the ethanol so that we could re uh, remove the pipes and whatnot. Uh, but uh, yeah, next episode, my friends, this is exactly what we are going to do. We're going to rebuild the cooling loop for this particular area. Make sure that the temperature is uh, taken care of. And uh, we are also going to add to the farm itself. Because uh, the farm is pitiful right now. It was it was meant to be like permanent in the ranch area, temporary in the farm area. We're gonna turn this into a farm like this. Because look at that, we have zero fibers remaining. Kind of bad, you know. We might even need to build the um, the the thingy for the gas masks again, just to allow dupes uh, to go outside and and, and do stuff. Um, in fact, in fact, guys, you know what? Sorry, uh, this is the. I just, it's just that I'm gonna forget. Uh, dupes that go outside a lot. Ashcan, he has a ton of morale. Good meal, and uh, that's like whatever. Exosuit training. Will that push your needs too far? You, we seriously need the rocketry piloting and piloting to get the exosuit training. It should be the other way around. Just saying, uh, but. We, we um, need this one, so the, the sustainability, so bam, 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 right? Karen goes outside a lot and she's already has this one, bam, bam. Lyra, guess what? Bam, bam. Liam, um, you're gonna need for the mechatronics, so you know what? Bam, bam, bam. Mima, you don't go outside much, you go outside a bunch, so bam, bam, bam. Quinn, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. There we go. And you as well. Bam, bam, bam. Perfect. This should allow our suits to uh, hold on just a little bit longer. Maybe we can still save ourselves and uh, don't need to go back to the oxygen masks. <clears throat> but yeah, next episode we will definitely start by fixing this. Then uh, our storage, because there is just ice and melting stuff and pee and garbage and just awfulness everywhere. You know, so uh, we'll take care of that and many other things as well. Uh, now that we have the power, these things still spewing stuff. This is ready. They stopped. The sulfur came back to its natural habitat. We can then get rid of it if we so desire. And uh, yeah, my friends. Uh, everything can now go back to quote-unquote normal. You know, uh, by the way, could you not do that anymore? Because, you know, we don't need it. And, uh, and uh, you know, it's one of those things. Uh, we don't need any more glass. 
into that and uh, now if oh, sorry for about my dogs if you can listen listen to them oh no that there is lead right there that's gonna be terrible um now i noticed the the one thing we um can expose that thing uh in our living room but uh uh, this thing should spew different uh, stuff according to the temperature of the stuff inside of it. The initial input temperature determines the, ter determines the type of material emitted. So this thing emits uh, igneous rock, rust, and uh, salt, uh, and dirt, uh, every single time. I noticed th those are the four outputs. Uh, you can see them right there. Salt, uh, 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 rust, uh, the dirt gets cooked, uh, but uh, it's there as well. Maybe if we put other things in there, very toasty things, maybe these things will spill different different materials. Who knows? All that I know is that we are done for today, my friends, and I'm super excited about the results that we were able to achieve. So, as we stated, next episode we will fix everything, and um, don't worry, because this is not going to be the end of the series. Uh... Even though we have finished the DLC specific uh, requirements uh, to finish the game, uh, we still need to do the other three because, uh, you know, I am suspecting that the DLC is not just this planet. I am suspecting that the other planets which we cannot see. Look at that. What is that? Do you know what that is? I don't know. We'll have to explore, right? Right. I think that's probably meteor showers, if I had to guess. Uh, but, um, yeah. There is so much more to explore in this new DLC that we could not stop here. But I'm just rambling, so let's cut it here and uh, see each other in the next episode. So, my friends, with all of that said, I hope that you have enjoyed this episode and that you are enjoying the series so far. If you are, please consider subscribing and help the channel grow. Also, given that we got this thing done today, how about you leave a comment and a like down below? Hmm... But with all that said, this is Abyss Manager signing out. Hmm. Bye bye.